Hi. <clears throat> Two more to fire the prelim. Kinda cringe, but... Seems like pioneer prelim... You know... Not in high demand right now. A day before the pre-release, I guess? The set is, what, Tuesday on Modo? Oh, one more, one more. Why people are not playing Pioneer Prelim? Yeah. Let's use the Jivetnasta. I know it's Jivetnasta. 19th, 19th hour. Song request MFG Bagno. No, przyszedł, zesrał się i poszedł. Fine, fine. Yeah. All right, one more gamer for us to prelim. Four rounds of extreme gaming. Jak poszedł, jak jestem. No dobra, jesteś. One more pioneer gamer. No! <laughs> No, who left? Who left? Ah, oh, it's just shining the deck, good. It was one big pin just changing some cards around, good. Everything is fine. That, was, that is acceptable, but he did scare us. They did scare us. How long do they wait before it gets called off as a bad job? Well, typically how those events on Modo not firing go is that... Like we each hold each other hostage for some time. Before somebody breaks out and drops. And then, once it goes to 10, then somebody else is like, oh, fuck, this is not firing, and also drops, and then it just snowballs, and He's almost everyone drops. Control player. And then, uh, once the event is empty and assuredly not firing anymore, it's, it's just gonna be gone. It's removed by a modo admin after like half an hour or something. But we just need one more, one more Pioneer Gamer. Thank you, Yudaya, for gifting a sub to Komataman. Which... Dot TV slash canister MTG broskis. I need your help. One more to fire the pioneer prelim. It's also include a picture of my deck list to lure some be some people. I'll join if you mod me. Then we might not play the problem today. I would definitely join if MTGO were more accessible this instead of having such an awful economy. A. I don't get it.
<clears throat> I will not drop if you mod me. Good. The der derpa herp zero dziesięć. Thanks. So it's a Rammstein. It's Giga Rammstein. Like sounds identical. Is it the same guy? It's gonna fire chats, I believe. Will you? In you? No, somebody dropped. Come on, there's like, there's, there's a Pioneer RC in a month. Don't you want to play? Cześć powodzenia, no powodzenia potrzebujemy. I will join for five chests, well. You'll get them if you go for all. <clears throat> so there is a chance. Mickey Mouse format. Mickey Mouse format doesn't really work as an insult when there is a Mickey Mouse game that is much more successful and has much wider appeal than Magic the Gathering. So just, I don't know, work on your game. Is Sounders packed a free spell? Like, in literal sense, it is a free spell. It is a spell that you cast for no mana. But in practical sense, it doesn't do anything for zero mana, so it doesn't really function like a free spell in practice. Like, it doesn't have the... It doesn't do anything. Well, I, I know what Sounders Pack does, but it doesn't impact the game, right? The board, it just like nothing happens. It's just extra Titans. Like, it's a Titan, but actually worse. Bagno, na ten film nałożono ograniczenia wiekowe. No dobra, to słuchamy w YouTubie. Hey guys, is it still cool to hate Pioneer? Pioneer, worst, yeah, worst format. That's like saying drawing cards does nothing. Summoner's Pact is a primeval titan. You end up spending mana on that primeval titan. When people have an issue or talk about free spells, 
this just what vastly different when you have a free spell that's interactive, right? That does stop you from doing something. It's pretty clear to me that Sounder Spark is a free spell only in the like most literal sense. Also, if you pay, you pay for it the next turn. Yes, Gitaxian Probe is a free spell. I guess. <laughs> but, like, you pay for the Titan. <laughs> Trust me, but <laughs> then you still pay for it. All right, leave event. We're gonna play league, bros. Well, you are you are allowed to play the fifth titan. That's like the that's the thing. That's the upside. That's like. I don't play League in a while. <clears throat> We're not talking about the Titan. Saying Pack does nothing is a bit disingenuous in my opinion. No bro, you just don't get my point. You pay zero mana for your Pact, what happens? in the game. You have a titan in your hand, but nothing happens. Nothing changes. Things change only when you tap your lens, space 6, and play your titan. Yorian. Obviously, when somebody is going to s say on the internet, I hate free spells in modern, and they're not gonna mean Sounders pack, doesn't make sense. They're gonna mean Fossil Negation, Solitude, Subtlety. Not even Endurance. I really can't tell if you're making a genuine argument or just trolling. Me or Chimba? So I'm the most genuine. How the fuck am I trying bros? Just... Bros. Just can't. Is Dread Return a free spell? Sure. Zerg, so the real question is Solitude more of a Moldrifter or a Bane Slayer? Obvious. This is here on fire, seems like.
kind of hard to sometimes optimize damage from Steam Keen. But I think we'll manage. Like dealing one less like this. So Sauner's Pact is a is a way in which uh Titan gets to play more Titans than normal decks do. So it is true that Titan has a cheat code in the format of modern, where it gets to play eight copies of a single card while most decks don't. I watched yesterday's Super League. What decks will you bring for your roster? I actually have not. I'll actually take a look. I'm kind of interested to see how it went. My roster is pretty, pretty low, pretty uh, late, and also has Doom Wake in it. It also plays a six drop with one land. Is that three? Well, it's plays a six drop with six mana. Doom Wake equals buy, roughly speaking, yeah. Not far off. Am I allowed to stream my matches for the MSL? I don't know, probably not. How much tea, girls, I need to donate in order for you to bring song of people. So? The Song of People, the Song of Creation deck with New Bergen Tutor. One one day I thought about Song of Creation and I realized that it gets host pretty hard by <sighs> We beat Leila Binding on this, we beat Leila Binding I mean don't really be Leila Binding on this, but we're in a good spot. I realized that Song of Creation cannot combo through an Orkish Bowmaster, which was a bit sad. So, zabijasz mi kurwa z Team Kina? No dobra, no przegrałeś w chuj, co? Nie wygrasz. Takie gry, kolego. Nie masz szans. Wow, I'm su such a strong Yorion deck. I'm grinding and grinding and grinding and doing 
I guess I could play... Mm. What could they do? Alright, the scariest line would be... Incarnation into... Atarka? But still leaves me with a creature. Lockdown would be annoying. No, I have a Swiss spear that has haste. Don't believe Enigmatic Fires is an actual viable deck. It surely barely looks like a deck, yeah. It has very... Very... How to put it? It has very free spell summoners packed vibes. It feels like a like a plate of puke. And like the puke was from eating many delicious dishes. But it's served in the way I described. Which makes it unpleasant actually. That's how it feels to me. If I came up with a goldy standard deck, how should I approach it? The more I keep it secret, the less I can work on tuning it. Play with your... Uh, play with... Who else is? Is Zer going to Worlds? Play with Zerg. If he's not going to Worlds, even better. O, zajebiście, Wodja, no, super. Kurwa, no i zesra zesrałem się normalnie z wrażenia. O, 8 życia masz, super. Myślisz, że cię nie zabije? Chyba nie myślisz tak. Time to play our deck. Or is it? Version of this deck from Questing Druid from Eldraine, maybe? But you can't really splash in such a deck. Would Green Ignis be infinite mana here? With the Steam Keens? Sure, yeah, I mean, what? Yeah. What wouldn't be? Like, Ren's Resolve is infinite mana here. For most, in most, uh, He's a phenomenal control player. Know, for the most part. Is based. It's five, six.
Ja. Spray play Pia. I can put counters on on the thopters and that's gonna kill. Yeah, GG. <laughs> yeah, GG. <laughs> GG bro, GG. <laughs> good game. I mean, it was pretty good, I think. It's pretty fun turn to, to go through. Would I actually kill uh, four of those creatures? They, like, one of them is unblocked, steals four. At least. Because we, we should, probably could make, like, Simkin be 5-5 five, five, too. I probably made too much money, I don't know. I thought that is like... I thought that would be 1 damage and then it would be... 1, 2, 3, 4 damage plus the top there and then it would be... 7 damage from the top, yeah, yeah. And then also 2 more top there's, yeah, so the top there's would kill. Could use like destroy all enchantments or something. Of Boros Charm in my cyborg, which is useless. I'll just resubmit. Maybe two chained for two Boros Charm. That seems better actually. Yeah, back to nature. Hmm. And they played what? Fable, two bindings, fires. It's four enchantments. It's Oscar? Or is it Kumano? It's Oscar, I think. Because Oscar then it deals 2 damage. Like, when it goes to 15. Probably... Like having a disenchant in the sideboard could be useful. There's probably some Boros disenchants if you would want a red card still. Like Shattering Blow, is that the name? No, that's just artifact. 
I guess it's hybrid, so it can be enchantment. A Grease Funk player played a lockdown, yeah, fair. Played an untapped one. Well, Kumano only puts a counter on one creature only ever. It doesn't if it if it did what you thought, then I would do that, yeah. But it's the next creature spell this turn. Wow, strong move. Enchantment played. Oh man. I had two oh man of the sea in my regional players tour second place in deck chat. By the way, as a way to trigger revolt, win with Tassus Oracle when I have one card or three cards in my deck, and just like as an as a country, it was a bit awkward because it's Dick through time, but it probably wouldn't be in my deck at this point. And it was cut from the deck by like most people shortly after, which makes sense. Hole. We play Pia. I could rent resolve and PR is stronger on the next turn, but not without not with a counter. Let's resolve. Maybe I'm gonna gonna get a swift spear or something. Ghost looks like they should go harder than they do. Ghost is puzzling. I what I hated for some reason, but oh, then like I actually listened to some of the songs and I was surprised and I f think I heard something different from them in the past. So I was at a concert festival. Where ghosts played, and I remember not liking it live. But also, when I hear a song by Ghost requested by Nobody Knows, Nobody Knows I'm a Dog, I'm surprised by what I'm hearing. So this is indeed a pop song. Interesting. Hmm. Night of Autumn. No, zajebiście, masz fajnie. Because Night of Autumn is the shittiest card. A friend of mine said the ghost vocalist sounds like Weird Al, I agree. Weird Al? Yeah. Really does. <laughs> There's an older Japanese band called Ghost that I like, so I'll never forgive these dorks for stealing the name. It's a generic enough word that probably there is a decent amount of bands called Ghost. 
if I had to guess, but thankfully I do not need to guess. I can Google, which I won't do. Pia bound. What if Boros Charm dealt 7 damage to face? Would it be played in modern and non burn decks? If that were the case, or would it be not powerful enough? Let's say we would have to remove the target creature against double strike until end of turn for balance. Yeah, 2 mana 7 damage. But no double strike. Fifty percent to target an opponent. Alright, but no, fifty percent is too wild, but let's say you just have to roll a die and on one your Boros Charm malfunctions and shoots you instead, yeah. So there is one six of a chance, so like 15%. Would you want to copy the charm if it can shoot you for seven? And when you copy it, there is a higher chance it's going to malfunction. He's a phenomenal control player. Senor Pedro. Hello, Marcelo Pez Lagos. Thank you for the sub. It could do 1d8 damage, yeah. <laughs> You'd just play Krark's Thumb if it was a coin flip, you probably wouldn't. Do you have Incarnation, brother? And if you do, what you doing? Clever Impersonator, wow. Pog Champion. So you're dead to a spell. Cool. Am I German? No, I'm Polish. Land on top. Probably still lose, brother. If that was your best play. Okay, no offense. I had none taken, it's fine. Alright, we won. But are you sure you're not German now? Yes. <laughs> Space Marine sings I'm still standing by Elton John. I was the prelim, it's not firing, I dropped. 
It's already gone. This deck loses to itself from what I see. It's very fun. My deck? The Pia deck? Are Poland and Germany bro countries or do they hate each other? If you are old and you remember at the times of World War II, then you might, or your parents do, then there's a higher chance that you are holding negative associations and feelings with the concept of Germany. I'm already a generation removed. Your stream decker is Rhino, so what? Alright, I guess I'll fix it. You're definitely playing this deck only because it sounds like Boros beer in Polish. It does not sound like Boros beer. P Pia Peach means to drink, so I guess it sounds like that a little bit, but they stretch. The Gruel Joy is going to give this deck a boost, I think. I don't think I'm gonna play a green card in my deck. It's Pioneer Brothers. You can't play like uncastable cards. To pee is to drink. Peach is to drink. Like how you splash it. Chain to the rocks. Kind of a big, big card in the deck too. Ech, chuj, kurwa, po mnie już. Dead. What's the weakest color in Pioneer? Blue. I don't know, I mean, I guess maybe green is besides mono green existing. White. I think it's green. Does Mono G exist if Karen goes? Goes where, huh? Goes to the farm? Dziki. Dziki chcę zobaczyć. NGL Phoenix with more one mana country looks promising though. I'll play with Slade and Phoenix, yeah. Sounds decent. Entire format can brief if Karl Nictus goes. The entire chat can brief too.
It's just combo prejudice, bros. Like entire format can brief, but then you still understand that the game is still like adversarial, right? You are competing against your opponent. You're trying to beat them in a game. Like, the jacks are still going to be trying to beat each other and you're not gonna chill, people are gonna try to beat you and there's likely gonna be a deck that is slightly strong at beating other decks. It's not even, like, it's not even the case. Like, mono green doesn't even perform well, particularly. Would Lotus be too strong in Pioneer? Probably. He's a phenomenal control player. Pioneer Stonks format. I'd play Rhydos Sacrifice with Lotus. Wait, but that's no Mayhem Devil. But hey, it's it's gonna do. Hey, Fable, Sh Shmabel. Fable, most overrated card worldwide. Obnixilis is like, whatever. I mean, I can play with no Obnixilis. Well, Shodred is, yeah, overrated less than Fable, but it's overrated. Any five walk canister cards in Eldrain? I don't know yet. Set review is tomorrow. When Reddit says Lurus and Pioneer would be nice since players would have to decide between a companion and Fable. I mean, it is a decision. It's not too bad. Sounds fair to me. Counterpoint Fable has won three straight Pro Tours in three different formats. Okay. Oh, it's a pretty solid argument, so I'll just ignore it. Black green food might be the next best thing with Lurus. In Pioneer? Alright bros, remember that... Bantag, Bantog is not welcome. I don't know if you're aware of that, but... Just keep pushing. Enjoy the Silex. I die to land removal. We attack with two creatures. Oh, yeah.
What the pity Lothar needed was for the throne deck to play four fables and the ritual would be complete. Yeah, sure, okay. Is it okay to dislike playing with or against chain because it makes paper board states look messy? Yeah, it's horrible. He's a phenomenal control player. What is my point doing? Well, Sunday time smile. shadow emotion during Jesse. It's Sunday time walk. They're short one mana. Yeah, ossification, same thing. This is a time walk, okay. Seems like they only have dirt in their hands, good. But yeah, I hate playing with Chained, especially against Incarnation. With this, a little bit less, but still annoying. But like in this deck, you can just kind of more easy to put Chained to the side. Incarnation more relevant with Bosejo because their bound their bounties are non basics. Should we remove mana? Can grab Giganta, but the power might matter. I'm feeling lucky though. He's a phenomenal control player. Letters A B in square. 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 Let the question that I won this game. Letters A B in square. 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 Please stop. Letters A B in square. 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 Yes, no, you scorn us, Kurva. A B in square. Letters A B in square. How long is this? Letters A B in square. Thank you for the sub, friend. Yeah, I can stop it. I, I don't know how exactly. I don't have a shortcut. I mean, I, it's not clear to me where the shortcut is, but assuredly is somewhere in Streamlabs. Let's have bone crashes here. No, Zerg, I for sure call you a friend. But it's kind of an insult, so. Well played, Kani, what a game. Yeah, I'm surprised I won that game. I thought I was kind of dead early, but my opponent blanked on their treasure cruise. But yeah, I also hated playing Yorion with Abundant Grove. Abundant Grove? Abundant... Is this called abundant, abundant something? The Abundant Grove. I think Abundant Grove.
yeah utopia sprawl is fine because it's like among your lands but it actually adds one mana which is just like what you would expect a land to do so if it's amongst lands it's fine The top deck in a format can be fun, interesting to play against. Mono G is not that deck, lol. Did you really wait 10 minutes to post that? Is it gonna be Ethergast? Impressive. Ah, it's sure, it's fine. A creature is a fine draw. I usually just lump a Baron Grove on top of a land. Like that it fully covers it? That's fine. Okay, I really dislike it when people have abundant growth land like on top of a land because it's just really easy to get confused as to how much mana the player has available. But of course there is other risks of confusion. Rens resolve. Top work is Vielki cut. You saw me to see the best, yeah. Potężna. You can't turn to company in the upkeep, though. Why? Wow, you can just play Arbor Elf He's into Utopia Pro Pass upkeep company. Player. Mr. Oh, Steve I guess your upkeep, yeah, yeah. I fought their upkeep stupidly, but of course it's your upkeep. Why would you want to do it in your own upkeep? It's a joke. There was a player at the first American regional championship who played Angels with foil cards and decided to play an upkeep company and then when there was a judge call and he was asked about his reasoning he said that he felt like it's gonna be better or like he had a feeling or something like that but turned out that in actuality some of the cards in his deck were curled block bro When homemade pierogi cooking stream, I don't really have like a setup for that, but I think my kitchen is a bit small for for that. Probably fine. Maybe one day cooking stream with canister. Are false banned in RC type level tournaments or only discouraged? No, false are fine. Marked cards are not. Kappa. How many more subs do I need for the better revenue share? Oh, many more. As you see, my total amount of subs dropped to 350 when I lately reduced the stream time so it's probably not gonna be hit anytime soon Dwa peniksy wraca, no to jestem wyjebany
The funny thing is that, at least in my experience, secret letter, not secret letter, collector booster foils are actually, they don't care. Which is the true pay to win situation. Dude, we brought in Bone Crusher, Shining there. I think I prefer Bone Crusher to Shocks, but maybe I'm wrong. And I don't really want Steam Keen against their deck, and Bone Crusher is a creature in a grindy situation. Would be better in a Rest in Peace game for sure. I only have two Rest in Peace though. Would you have a bigger kitchen if you want the Mythic Invitational? Likely. I have a... How is it called? Like my kitchen and my living room is one room, like one big room connected. What's the term for that chat? Kitchen Annex, no, tak się mówi. Aneksik mam kuchenny, yes, yes. Kitchenet. <laughs> Is that a real word or... Kitchen room. <laughs> Kitchen room. Oh. Okay, we drew change the cocks. The problem is that we need more than that. So let's show, show some downs. Can technically beat nothing, so Kitchenet is what we use, it's a real word, okay. Sounds absolutely real. Any kitchenettes in the chat? Oh no, opponent kept stop. Mm. 
Let's see, a bone crusher. Hmm. I don't know. It's possible Steam Keen is better than Bone Crusher. What did you whisper into Tafu's ear? I drank tea. That's what I said. I said I drink tea. No, oh, I like the Bone Crushers. Let's give them another chance. Why don't you believe me? Because of what you said about Sounder Spike, that it impacts the game heavily. Fucking Sounder Spike. Imagine your opponent Sounder Spikes and passes. Is the game impacted heavily? Tell opponent to turn off animations, that should lower the lag. What if they already have their animations turned off and I sound like a... Mansplainer. I don't want to risk it. My hand is pretty good against a shock. Not anymore, I guess. But I guess we can can take it. Like, I don't know, just I'll point post it what they post in the chat. I appreciate that. I will not share advice that is not not necessarily wanted by them or like who knows, but like I don't care also like the lack can happen for many reasons. It could also not be because of the animations. So I'll just hit them with my swift spears instead. Real Magic Gamers don't need protection. In what way? Alright, no Brotherhood's End. Maybe in the way that we need more gamers in the world to save it. No, yeah, brother. No, huh, bug? Kurva, no, chujowo. What's going so well? Can you trash talk about your modern Super League pod opponents on stream to build suspense and tension? I don't think I ever talked to... to Jesse. And I think Caleb is cool. So... You know... I think Doomwake is gonna be an easy buy though. Yeah. Alright, headlands. Does isn't it ruin your tiebreakers though? Yeah. This is my pod. Why is my PC lagging so much? Week 4 continues. September 21 p.m. PDT. Canister. Caleb Durward. Jesse Robkin. Devon O'Donnell. 
Why is it Kanister and like why isn't it Doomwake? Does he not care about his brand? Seems like. Image to scale, yeah. <laughs> What's my middle name, Kaniki? Tadeusz. He's a phenomenal control player. Tadeusz, why have Thanks for the content. All right, Bone Crusher Giant is looking absolutely ass. Next time I will not board Bone Crusher Giant against that. If you lose to Doomwake, will I be able to ask questions about a topic I'm not supposed to ask? Kurwa, no mówię ci, jak się chcesz zapytać, to, to, to nie na streamie, to ci powiem ile mi dali w tym, w tym, w tej, li nie w lidze, w tym konsultowaniu. Znaczy nie powiem ci, ale wiesz. No i tak jest. Tylko na streamie męczysz bułę, no to, to ci nie powiem. <clears throat> the idea of getting a thopter even with adventure dryad sounds good but i don't think it will ever happen i think there's zero chance the mana holds lost to phoenix Cut Alpine Moon, add rest in peace. I think if we have rest in peace, the matchup should be pretty good. We have removal for all their monsters and we also have card advantage to match. Ooh, all four. All right, you won. Last one, rest in peace. Have you ever rested and peaced? What is that? What, is that? what does that even mean, though? <laughs> rest and peace. I not gonna let the game bully me. I'm keeping this. Tempulo Garden. Traverse the Ulewald. Swamp. Cool. Chain to the rocks and play with fire is a great removal suit against Griswank. JK, it actually is not. A PR top desk can get pretty big though. Resting in peace, much worse than rest in peace. Yeah. If you don't enjoy that, then for sure. Point revealed a grease fang. Shield Red and Sky Sovereign. No to trochę jesteśmy wyjebani. Worst matchup in the format. Very sad. This is the worst matchup? Like I always, whenever I lose to Griswang, I feel unlucky because I'm assuming that they, that they won't have it. And they do have it pretty often, so it's a little bit tricky, but it's a common thing that people say that Greasefang is their worst matchup, but also how it ca how can it be the worst matchup when it's like an unplayable deck? Doesn't even have land number three, but is that collective brutality or Tassigur? Aye, ah, brutality. Well, that beats me anyways.
I mean, I'm the cyborg, I'll just... I have how many vending volleys? Three? Two rest in peace, three vending volley. Well, it's not that much, but... You also have an unplayable deck, so it evens out, sure. Steam Keen and Chain also great versus with Bloom Command. Fair. Speaking of... Alright, next time Guri Svan going to Sky Sovereign. Dobra, no chuj ci w dupę, jak tak mi zagrywasz w Ocisa, to ja zczubię coś fajnego. Na przykład Solskara, dobra, wgrać. They had a face of Greasefang into Sky Sovereign and to kill two of my monsters and keep Greasefang in play, yes. Have I played the Pioneer Dredge deck? I might be, I am unfamiliar with, with it. Should I cut Chained? Probably. Spike, 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 spike. Please play Ragdos or Tron, Spaceback, Smart Face. In my Super League or in general? Don't want to cut a one drop. Maybe remove a Steamkin. Not sure. Steamkin kind of pops off, but can be punished by Wither Bloom. If I have to play it on two, can't lose. Spike, 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 spikes. Ask me if I played Dredge, sends me a deck named Grixis Cut Oven. Damn, first place. You think it's worth it? Can I add the RCQ? What does that change? They play Wither Bloom, it's actually okay. Electric piano from Vish. Reddit.com R slash unexpected. Seems dangerous. <laughs> Thinking it takes play because it wins one turn is dumb, yeah.
true chads think that no deck is playable, especially the ones that win. Or well, something. Oh no, my ass. My ass is store. I bought it out chain, so if they play Shouldered, I'll be sad, actually. They got the Okiba boss. They chose Plumbing Marsh instead. Not even Razorverse Ticket. Duress. No Zybeast is a fine image. No Vehicle, no White Mana, interesting. They're probably gonna play Chariot and I'm gonna die to it because I'll throw a land. Grisang is a girl. Yes, it's more apparent, it's like... There is like a... Ponytail, so obviously. It's more apparent in the alt art, which is not on model, so you don't see it as often. No, so the Parhelion of Grabu, so I Lol, tak bo pachły. They are adding enchant all the wee bars to enchanting tales. Cool. I mean, how dare they? How how would they dare not add them? Would be insane. I hope I can draw a card. Steam King traded for Witherbloom and was bad. Red Hack H high quality. Who do pa kurwa chipa mały obrazek sto twarzy grzybiarzy. Nice. They took a land and now they're taking all the... Hmm, interesting. So they have nothing. They took a land with... Uh, they took the Blooming Marsh to duress me. I guess they were scared of Showdown. Let's draw the Showdown now. Okay, draw. What does this mean? Ha ha ha, do you pay two for the cards you drew? Of course you don't. My tithe is too much for you. Look at my pile of treasures. This is far more than you'll ever have. Still don't get the artwork. Is she ashamed? Is she crying? Is she sad? Is she laughing with her? Because she seems laugh like she's smiling. Yes, we drew something. Reap in peace, why not? He's a Rip the rest in peace. Player. Rip the skin. Waiting room. Read with the girl's voice, Mr. Streamer. I can't do girl voice. 
I have too much testosterone and uh, alpha maleness. Also, okay, Blayad, thank you very much for the sub. Will it be DMCA if you watch leaked gameplay footage of Starfield? Yes. Would I describe myself as a natural chad? I mean, sure, I could. Whether that would be truthful, maybe it would be a little bit of a lie, but I could say that. I think I prefer bone crashes here too. Over the Steam Kings. The Steam Kings match up too poorly against the minus one, minus one, and like the Storm sucks, but. Want some monsters? Kumano can also be bad against command. <laughs> Giganta. No dobra, keep. Co mi tam? Najwyżej mnie wypierdoli Griswank on turn 3. But they move to 6, they won't have it. Moving on to five, fourth sister one. Ruszam się jak trapstar. Yo. Ruszam się jak trapstar. Spójrz na moje kroki, to ruch jak mili łoki. Jestem jeszcze lowki. No w sumie jesteś słodki. Koala. Nice throw. All right, time to face Kakazan. Hopefully my opponent doesn't cast a perfect Grizzly Salvage right now. Nikasi Grizzly Salvage. Grisfang no vehicle, whatever bro. To ruch jak mili woki. Take two, play Guris Fango naked. Cool. Attack for four. Good shrink Guris Fang, which means that Parhelion actually doesn't work anymore, but it kind of works sometimes still. So let's deal four and hit land. Post combat prowess, let's go. Mm. 
Oj, 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 vi då? 1, 2, 3, 4. Nothing. Idiot. Hey, do you think any of the new slots in this deck, they trigger Pia? Any new, any new what? Adventure cards? Uh, I mean, like, can you get the, like, green splash to be minimal and just play the card as a reckless impulse? It is worse, though, because in instance, it's worse at triggering prowess. I don't know if there's any other adventures that fit. There's the Boros one, right? Which is like life gives lifelink. And it's three mana deal three. Mm. Then the two mana three one white creature. Doesn't seem so good. Maybe in the sideboard. But I just I just assume that there is no way that you can play free mana free color aggro deck, so I just ignore that possibility. And then also you'd have to forsake chain to the rocks, which is which is costly too. But you're making topless when you cast a creature from exile. Yeah, I get this. Hey, Piotr, what are you playing in modern? Just playing various decks and prelims. Nothing I'm very focused on right now. If I were to play a challenge this weekend, I'd play, I don't know. Scum, Rhinos or Merktai, just a stock deck. Breeding Pool, Lotus. Is there a deck you would recommend for the RC? Well, I'm finding, I'm searching for one. It's a very light synergy, probably not good enough. I mean, the synergy is fine, just the problem is... Oh, carry out it. The problem is simple, that mana doesn't work. Like, you can't cast those cards, it's impossible. That's it, that's all. It's nothing else that's, like... <coughs> nothing else that's important. Like, you just can't cast the cards. Simple. Maybe it's Ascendancy, but this is probably not with those lands. Turn three skulls, how? Alright, um... This is the Kinan combo that won the last challenge. Alright, we're gonna observe the combo and unfold in real time, then. Alright, I'm not gonna pretend, maybe they're gonna flash in a 2 free creature. Can and combo league next, unlikely. Plaza of Heroes, okay. Red. Mm -hmm. Red. Green. 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 Luca. I've I've read the words Luca Rona. Kinan somewhere. Traction Helix. Diva, Retraction Helix. Karn. Alright, cool. Mox Amber, Elvish Mystic of, of Nyssa, Karn the Great, Content Creator and Breeding Pool, cool. 
Mox Amber, ok. To improve the Atraxa UI. Too bad, I thought it was a nice touch. So it's a deck that can actually plus Luca and reveal creatures with it. Nice. Labra, let's. It's gonna be hard to win, probably, but. Say the white land. Kill Luca. The red green adventure man is also a worse version of the impulse draw two in the deck because you can never play two lands from it. More importantly, even you just want to cast it during your opponent's turn and you have prowess creatures in the deck which you could not have the prowess creatures i guess but luca love extracts peace into coma i don't remember that but probably happened I barely played the card, Luca. Kind of something. Something I disliked, like I hated. Discard Luca, okay. Don't want Luca. Maybe has more Luca. Lucazzo. They found Retraction Helix, so now they combo. There was also no tax Yorion at first, right? And you went like Luca, get an agent, Yorion, Blink, the agent, still on their land. Find a deck more as pro boy. Yeah, but you know. Lol, you guys obviously didn't remember the Oko meta. Yeah, clearly that's the only available explanation, maybe. It's not that the other Twitch chatter actually disliked that format slightly more than the other one. For example. I remember I played the, the Oko deck at the Oko PT and I played against Pablo Doritos one round and he 
he had the same jaw as I did, but on the jaw, and then he destroyed me still, and I was kind of puzzled by it. Felt bad. Felt bad as in, like, out, out scale, I guess, I don't know. Am I gonna try the Naya version of this deck with the new adventures? No, I will not play this deck after Eldraine releases because I know that if I do then people are, people are gonna ask about that shitty idea of splashing a third color in an aggro deck which is just plainly and clearly impossible. And I just don't want to put myself through it. Were you scared of Pablo? Not really. But I was just clicking my cards IRL and he was actually thinking of the moves and then he beat me. Have you considered that you may be sack? That's one plausible explanation. <laughs> Did think of that, yeah. If it's a Rona combo deck, maybe Rest in Peace could be okay. Seems, sounds terrible. What does it do? Makes Tivar minus not work? Wow. Wow. Play white mana. Well, you can splash the third color just not in an, a one drop aggro deck. Kinan is just absolutely broken. Look at this, it's insane. What should I eat for breakfast? No, never, never cereal for breakfast chat. Don't suggest that. Eat, uh... Yeah, just fast. Eat Cox is a much better suggestion than eat Kit Kat cereal. Jajuwa z maślanką? Nigdy nie dodaję maślanki do mojej jajówy. Sounds like a... Skąd w tam jeszcze? Iławski, Iławski thing? Sounds like it. What it's is it like like oats and seed type of cereal because I have that oats fine yeah. Destroy a mana source, I guess. Two mana sources, even. Means Batraxa is not hard castable while they land. I mean, they play elves. I want my shocks. What do I not want? 
They fought sees me. So that's why I'm shocking him now. Maybe I should throw away Kumana. They don't seem to have removal. What deck plays Steven and Atraxa? My opponent's deck. Alright, I can't board the last shock. Modo bug. Boner seem. Good, they don't. Trying to meta game with Super League Week versus Caleb and Doom Wake. I'll just play a good deck and lose to them anyways. Well, to do Caleb, not to Doom Wake. Byłeś kiedyś w Iławie? Nie przypominam sobie. Na jakie deki Alpine Moon, tylko Lotus Field. It's a long password, true, I should shorten it. When's the MSL thing? My weekend is, it's on Wednesdays, but my weekend is September 20th, so still a while from now. Dobra, who is the, no, jakoś tam. I think I have all three volleys in my deck, but I'm not sure. Yes, I do. Which is a visual bug. Is that the Wednesday before the Canic on Vegas? I don't know what's Vegas. I can enjoy toast, but also whole wheat stuff. Depends on what I eat with it and such. Um, damn, eye opening. Fort Caleb is just a cube gamer. Now you tell me he's a legacy gamer. Crazy. Good Dura. It's probably no reason to play turn one Sacred Foundry. Is there? What are the best toast toppings? They always have Mox Amber. Toppings. Six, six mana. All right. So like off care for me, but it just takes away four mana. Three mana. See difference between hard cast attacks and not.
Melted cheddar with hard boiled egg. Shit, now I want a hard boiled egg. Kurwa, obiad jest niewiedziony, ja zamrażarki, ja pierdolę, no. Miałem zrobić rano. No dobra. Kenan. Should have chained the first one. Is that Carnold? No, green black, that's Tivar. You can actually use skin and its ability to hit something good, which is rare. Not many decks can do that. Point can just minus get a kin and use kin and maybe hit Atraxa. That would be a problem, but that could also not happen. So I'll be trying to have that happen. Scrambled eggs with hot sauce, damn. Now I want some hot sauce. But not no eggs though. Punish for play with fire, how? I didn't really get punished for play with fire. I would just get fucked anyways. Same King Counter. You can't really say that, no. What fancy food do I cook to impress your lady friend, Mr. Streamer? It's not giga fancy, but last time we cooked uh, chicken with cashew with peppers. Any nice uh, Thai chili paste, paste sauce. But we also did that together, so I mean. I don't know if it makes it more or less impressive. Can go wrong with shrimp pasta. I don't love shrimps, so actually I can. But I also don't hate shrimp, so. Alright, next turn is gonna be epic. R right, there's gonna be an next turn, right? <sighs> what do I also do to impress my lady friends? I show her my magic collection and my Legos collection. What works like a charm. There might be no next turn, seeing that my opponent is 
performing combo actions and bouncing my creatures instead of bouncing the Mox Amber even. So I'll take a quick bathroom break.
Do I have it sealed or do I assemble my Legos? I assemble my Legos. I got this set uh, recently. It's called uh, Lego Tranquil Garden and it's kind of nice. I like it. Trees are removable and you can swap them around if that is something that you would enjoy doing. It also makes them that it also makes it so that they kind of wobble when you move it, which is kind of cringe. And I would prefer them; they were not remo removable. But uh, it was like nice to assemble. It's pretty nicely looking. It's the breeze. <laughs> Yeah. And if you flip it over and you look inside the little hut, the little house, you can see that there is like some objects in there that I think those are like slippers, the white ones. And then there is like cups of tea, green tea. Or maybe two toilets. It's probably two toilets. Makes more sense. So I, I like... Uh, I assembled my Legos, yes. Uh, that's the main reason why I buy them. But I... I find uh, the act of assembling Legos to be calming and nice. Do I ever destroy them to assemble them again? No, no, I don't do that. I used to do that. Uh, when I was a kid. But I just buy new ones now. <laughs> now when I, when I feel like assembling. Do I prefer assembling them or displaying them? Assembling? But I only buy the serious Lego sets just to make sure that not to be accidentally viewed as a man child. So I buy like, you know, Tranquil Garden, Gardens and uh, Lego Architecture. Because I... I cannot, you know, you cannot afford to be confused with a... with an immature being. Is that why you play the adult MTGO instead of the Montreal MTGA as well? Yes. The Great Wave Lego set is a fun one to build. Is it like the picture? I have not built any of those. They seem kind of awkward to me. Doesn't really feel like building a Lego when you build something, something flat, but probably it's fine. Let's size curva now. La Grande Vague, La Grande Ola. 
The lady is very happy with her headphones on and the Legos. Pretty big. Very happy scanning her QR code. What's up with the faces? What the heck? Legorinos are such yowzers. Yeah, exactly. The Lego doing it is only proof you're not a baby. Are you a baby? Yeah. The little faces are in the original art too. I need to look closer then. But yeah, I would think that the advantage of Legos is that they are 3D. YOLO. Why would I have removal in my deck, right? I mean, they cycle, it's fine, but it's high payoff if I don't actually, and I have shock, so it actually makes sense. Let's play Montagna. And let's chain, chain, chain the cocks. There is a Legoland in Boston and man children got mad because they don't let adults inside unless they don't unless they're accompanying children. So Legoland set aside one day a year where man children can go by themselves. Why would they not let man children? And sounds just like a poor strat. They scare kids. Well, they also have money. Kids don't have money. I don't know. Chad, do you know what's what are the lyrics and the title of the song? I guess you do. You know the word. Chipa means pussy, but like pussy has like a nicer feel than chipa, I think, like as a word, because chipa it sounds like a very ugly word, while pussy could be just kind of like, I don't know. Playful, by a better way to put it. Yeah, can't is yeah, can't. That's that's a better one. But there is also a second word which you could also translate as a can't, which also has like a similar vibe. So I just wanted to acknowledge that. LOL resolves, what a nerd. Should attack first, but... Bunya, Bunya, Bunya. Q 
Can you just rent a child? Go to an orphanage? I don't know, pay, pay fee. Take a child, chill, take a parentless child, an orphan to Legoland for a day. Never see, see the child again. Adults must be accompanied by at least one child, age 17 or under, to enter the LEGO Discovery Center. This is so funny. He's a phenomenal control player. Is that modern Super League competitor Kinesteur underscore MTG? Yeah, that's me. I bet you're very scared to wake. Of having me in your pod, so... I can only tell you one thing, gratefully so. No, they don't give orphans to man children. How hard is it to... Wow, gaslights there? Cool. How hard is it to... Get an orphan. There's the word adopt. Could ask Gavin wife about adoption. Probably. It probably depends heavily on where. Buja. Shedem, Oshem. So the 11, yeah, it's exactly 11. I wish all music was this heavy. Oh no, not the mausoleum wanderer. Ale burza daje. Aj, Luis, to jest muta volt. Oh no, we can do that. Damn. That's a bit rough.
<clears throat> oh no, that's the Muta Vault. You've fallen for my trick. Unless you have shackle geists. Other geist. Other geist is such a bad card. Let's cast a draw too. Spectra Sailor is a nice card advantage tool for my opponent, so we'll need to get rid of that. This is really bad. I guess I just ignore the land in exile. Volley rendered. Rendered? Rendering volley. Oh no, Perpetuum Mobile. We need a showdown of the skulls to catch up. Or Vesok would do the job too, but... You know. Added shit in my mouth with drums in position 9 to the queue. Thank you for adding this song to the queue. I appreciate it. Sky Club operation matches up decently against Chain to the Rocks. Is a bit of a problem. Although, a bigger problem is that the anime Spectral Sailor is not available on Magic Online. It is truly a shame. Bluff attack. It's not even a bluff. <laughs> I 
And I was not even thinking about it. I was just lamenting how unlucky I was to join land. But like I was attacking the entire time. Three, six, seven, thirteen. Oh, cool, Katilda. Not even activating Muta Vault. No need. Okay. We can win this turn. Or can we? I was defeated by the Spectre of Sailor. I don't know about Chain of the Rocks. It's not that good. Very bone crusher heavy hand. And before my opponent plays no one drop and the one free lord on turn two. Is two free flyer right then useful? No. She's never useful. Living on the darker ways is interesting. They play a darker ways. I assume they're gonna play something like the Spectral Shell EOT, and I want to play BGC on free. Play Pongrasha on free to have a Pongrasha and play, and even if it gets taken by Operation, it's great. Awesome draw. Ether Gast Gaming, cool. <clears throat> Opponent successfully two for one. You deploy Pia, opponent does nothing. Wow, that's awesome. What's their hand? No Queller, no Canters. Shitty removal. You want to play that fight? Cool. Good luck. I guess they might have Canters. Just saving them for my draw spells, but... I think they actually, they actually pretty likely to have some. No, they don't. Wow, it's so bad for them. Four lands. Four lands. Huh? Cool. Oh. I mean, it's fine, but funny. I play Pia, Nalar. 
I play Battlefield 4J. I play Soul Skarmage. I play Stompage. It's funny, the queller this, I actually get a top there. I should have two mountains. It doesn't look like it because of the all slick. It seems like the top of the all slick mountain, but I actually have two mountains. Take my top there and not PR. Cool. Rose anime girls are so cute. It's insane. How is such thing allowed to exist in the world. So perfectly engineered for that one quality. Aishiteru, them melting. With the quality of cuteness. Oh, I thought you meant cringeness because they're cringe. Yeah. We're actually gonna get a PR top there through this, which is awesome. We engineered cuts for cuteness. Anime is so much easier, true. Also, there was like, I've seen a thing in the disc, in my, in, in an, our Discord even, some like Reddit posts proving that anime girls are just modeled after cuts. Which, like, if cats were fast domesticated and engineered for being cute, or rather they themselves engineered them, evolutionary engineered themselves for being cute, then we just then transfer that into anime and, and make them look like that. Play Lotus one time. I played so much Lotus, my friend. So... Your message sounds like a demand, but I maybe just a question. Sounds like furry posting. It wasn't really. We got coastal piracy and Verdant Embrace. Wow, cool. I don't like to think myself of myself as a pirate. I'm more like a stimulator of the local economy. Rate the flavor text. Funny, not funny. Funny or not funny. Just one word verdict. I think it's pretty funny. Enchanted creature gets plus 3 plus 3 and has at the beginning of each upkeep unkeep create a green sub rolling. Wow. 
Oh, it's a reference to Verdant Force. This is insane. Butt chest. Need to... Need to... Yes, that's what I'm talking about. This dragon is so awesome. It's just it's so... Base, it's popping out of right of the cards and right out of my screen. I can feel the heat of its fiery breath on my chest. Radiating through my entire body. Nice experience. Is my PC so lagging today? I, I bet it's more of fault. We also got Balan, but in a non-anime version. Which is sad. Unplayable MTGO lag. Okay. Also had lag when I... Well, now it's like my entire computer, but so I don't know. They are live coding the new cards. Fair. So uh, we have to wait to see what's what's in the rest of the chests. The Balefire Dragon heat has affected your computer, probably. <clears throat> Download more RAM. Okay. Did I enjoy playing with Atmosphere Harvester in standard? I did play it. I did play it a lot. I don't know if I would say I enjoyed it particularly. I think I did. I think it was present in my Pro Tour top 8 deck. Let's find that. Let's find out. Pro Tour Xalan. Piotr, I can't do that on my second screen because I just, my PC is dead, it doesn't respond to my commands. Klogowski, top 8, deck list. Did you hear La Bomba? Okay. I was about to say that the gachi sounds a little bit scuffed, but it's impressive. I played 21 creatures, 3 bristling hydra, 2 scarab god, 16 energy creatures, 3 abrade, 4 harness lightning, 1 blossoming defense, 1 supreme will. Wow. Two Vraska Relic Seeker, one Supreme Will. I had no Aether Sphere Harvesters in my sideboard. I had one Chandra's Defeat, one Jace's Defeat, three Negate, two Nissa, one Appetite for the Unnatural, which is a free mana Naturalize, which sucked, two Cartouche of Ambition, 
It was against Monorail, that was pretty nice actually. Two Death Guard Scavenger, one Confiscation Cool, and two Reverse Rebuke. Powerful deck. All right, I'll be finishing the stream, but I don't know how to do that. Control I'll delete. <laughs> All right, closed model. Now we can do all the things. Classic reverse rebukes was so good. So we know the card has no subtype. It's newer than Izalan, not a rare, not blue. Three or less mana. So before we go, we can dissolve this. So let's go, well, no subtype, so it's not gonna be Platite Harvester, Volcanic, Spite. Probably better to guess Fire, Prophecy. Okay, common instance between 20 and 17, costing one mana in Abzan colors. So, blossoming defense. Oh shit. Oh wow, that's so wrong. I need to fire myself. But we know it's not green. Ephemerate sounds good. Okay, it's between the, it's in the it's from 2018. The fire strike was first in cans, bro. 2018. Black one mana instant, come on. Gideon's Sacrifice, that's a white card. It's also not from 2018, I think. So it can be Revas of Ixalan, Dominaria. Maybe it's gonna be Fungal Infection. It's from Dominaria. Black one mana instant, but what does that mean? That it starts with different like that it's earlier in the alphabet, I think. Blessing of Bells and Lock, yeah. I think that's the only other one mana instant from that set. Village Rights was not in the set, and Village Rights V also comes after F in the alphabet. I thought Blessing was uncommon. For us, this like, looks like the least uncommon effect you could print. How would this be an uncommon? Bells and Locks sound Slavic, not at all. Belzok maybe would... Belzok? Belzen... Belzenzok. Which sounds Slavic. Bells and Lock, nah. Balshock. <laughs> Uh, 
It was pretty uncommon to have this card in your deck, I guess. It kinda sucked. So maybe that's why you thought it was uncommon. Anyways, thank you for watching and tomorrow is gonna be the official set review of Wheels of Eldrine. So I will be reviewing Wilds of Eldrine and we're gonna be looking at Not Dead Yet and I'll be saying Oh yeah, yeah, that card, yes, is, is in Scum, yes, yes very good in scam what time tomorrow you'll get a you know i could give you a time but it would be a lie most likely so so you'll get a notification if you if you do that before or after lunch well you see i don't eat lunch but around noon, around noon. Wait some minutes for shit in my mouth. Alright. Nice. Funny happening, I guess. It's that was that what you called something like that? Shit in my mouth. Da -da -da -da. That's some real love. Also, Legoland Discovery Center, Boston. Do children have to wear sneakers? Children must wear shoes or sandals while playing in the center. Uh, obviously, because otherwise they would risk getting... Like, stepping on a Lego, which is the worst fate... Ha 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 ha. Alright. It hurts so bad. XD. <laughs> Updated modern mono black ring deck. Set review of Triask. 64 player Vintage Cube Arena Cube. I will play WoW Early Access tomorrow. Exclamation mark baby. What happens when I say exclamation mark baby? Goo goo gaga followers only. Ech. All right. Chad's getting a brother. It's not even a baby, it's just syringes. Oh. 
All right, let's raid the baby man. First, first I'll unfollow though. I got what I wanted. See you tomorrow. Do they fire the raid or do they fail? <sighs> Alright, let's go again. Why did I hear myself now? Crazy shit, bros. Right, did we do it? Did we raid him? Yes, Bo. 